SEMENYIH, Malaysia, the Prime Minister says he is puzzled as to how Datuk Seri Najib Tun Razik, who is facing money laundering charges, can be called a boss. And Dr. Mahathir Mohamad said he did not see how the former Prime Minister could be hailed as a boss, a clear reference to Najib's moniker Bosku. Dr. Mahathir said although Najib was still roaming free and making trips to Semenyi, he would be put in jail soon. When he comes here, even though he is charged, he is not arrested, he is not wearing the yellow clothes, lock-up clothing. It's not that we don't want him to wear the yellow clothes, it's only that he's not wearing them yet, but he will wear it soon, he said at Tesco Semenyi. Dr. Mahathir, who was campaigning for Pakatan Harapan candidate Mohammed Ayman Zain Ali, said he, Mohammed Ayman, would have the support and guidance of top party leaders. He looks young, a bit younger than me. Although he is young, he has the backing of many leaders, many are old leaders, the oldest being a 93-year-old who cannot stop talking, he said. Dr. Mahathir added that when the elected representative had the backing of the federal government, more could be done for the people. I hope people realize it is a by-election, not like a general election which gives political parties the chance to fight it out and form the government, he said. Dr. Mahathir, who is also Pakatan Harapan chairman, said they hoped to achieve a two-thirds majority in parliament so they could amend the federal constitution to allow for more changes. He said such changes would include bringing the voting age down from 21 to 18, and also to limit the Premier's tenure to two terms. We don't intend to limit the powers of the King. Let that be because it cannot be denied, he said. Pakatan needs to get 148 seats in the 222-seat Dewan Rakyat to have a two-thirds majority. Currently, Pakatan has 125 seats while Pakatan friendly parties, Party Waris and Sabarin Upko, hold 10 seats. Addressing a crowd at the Santai 2 Roda Semenyi 2019 program later, Dr. Mahathir justified accepting former UMNO members into its fold, saying that they were deadlocked if they do not join Pakatan and Bursa 2. So, once they understand our fight, we will accept them, the Prime Minister said. He added that as efforts were being made to achieve the required number of seats, certain individuals had pledged their support to him but that was not enough. I am not the party. Only when you support the party that changes can be done, he said. He added that it would not take long for Pakatan to achieve the two-thirds majority. During my time, Barrison National was able to achieve a two-thirds majority. But it couldn't be done under Datuk Seri Najib Tun Razik and I'm not sure why that is so, said Dr. Mahathir.